गुड इवनिंग आई एम डॉक्टर नेहा गुप्ता एंड आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक टू यू अबाउट कॉम्प्लिकेशन ऑफ मेनोपॉज सो द ईस्ट्रोजन हॉर्मोन इज प्रोटेक्टिव फॉर द हार्ट फंक्शन वंस द लेडी अटेन्स मेनोपॉज शी इज डेफिनेटली एट अ हायर रिस्क ऑफ हैविंग हार्ट प्रॉब्लम्स इन द फॉर्म ऑफ हार्ट अटैक्स और क्लॉट्स इन द ब्लड वेसल Uh, in fact uh, heart uh, disease or uh, heart attacks they are the leading cause of death in men and so is the case in women as well so one of the problems is that of heart attacks that is why it is very very important that menopausal women eat healthy they exercise regularly give up on smoke and alcohol have a regular checkup of their blood cholesterol levels the lipid levels the sugar levels have their bp checked at regular intervals and do uh, you know regular yoga and meditation so doing all of that would help to keep the risk of heart attacks or coronary artery disease to a minimum now the second complication is that of bone thinning so again estrogen is the hormone which is needed for bone health or the bone strength in women once they attain menopause the estrogen levels drop and so bone thinning happens uh, so this happens for most women once they attain menopause the decline in bone density or the bone uh, you know strength is at at a more rapid rate in the early menopausal years as compared to the later years so uh, calcium supplementation vitamin d supplementation aerobic exercises muscle strengthening exercises not smoking all these things are again very very important to maintain the bone health the third complication is that of sexual dysfunction uh, so we've talked about it earlier also that there are, there can be vaginal dryness and uh, there can be frequent episodes of vaginal infection so uh, there could be low uh, libido that is there could be a reduced desire to have sex all that happens because of the dropping uh, estrogen levels to manage that one can use vaginal lubricants vaginal moisturizers or local estrogen therapy which also i have talked about earlier in the video that can prove to be beneficial to counter this complication the fourth is the urinary complication also i have talked about it earlier that there could be problem of stress incontinence or there could be problem of urge incontinence so to manage that again uh, you know uh, having an optimum body weight doing the kegels exercises not smoking regulating the fluid intake all that is very very important and uh, also post menopausal females they are more prone to have frequent urinary tract infections so again uh, maintaining a good personal hygiene a good perineal hygiene sometimes use of local estrogen therapy all that can also help with the urinary complications uh, the next complication is that of weight gain the menopausal women are at an you know they they do tend to gain weight uh, the females particularly around the waist and it is this type of weight gain which is there around the waist and the hips is actually one of the uh, components of something which we call as the metabolic syndrome now metabolic syndrome has other components to it like having uh, high cholesterol levels having high sugar levels that is being a pre diabetic or a diabetic having high uh, blood pressure so all these are actually risk factors for having a heart disease so developing a blood clot in the you know the vessels which are going towards the heart which are draining the heart so uh, to reduce the risk again uh, i would like to emphasize that lifestyle is the most important eat healthy and do a regular exercise and of course the last set of menopausal complications that i'd like to talk about is that of uh, you know dementia memory loss so uh, well uh, you know e hormone replacement therapy is not the one which is very beneficial to manage dementia and if that is the case uh, that is setting in then it is always good to take the opinion of a neurologist so that was all about menopause so i do hope that you've enjoyed the session and it has been informative 
uh, if you have any um, you know queries or doubts uh, do uh, leave it in the comment section and we'll try to get back to you as soon as possible also if you like our channel please do like subscribe and share bye bye and i'll see you soon